graduated from Melbourne Business School with an MBA um, and that networking that I have created at that MBA um, has really helped me in Shanghai. Networking is so important. Um, if, if I didn't have a network, not I would be lost. I mean, I wouldn't know about salaries, I wouldn't know about competitive landscape, I wouldn't know about which organizations to join, and I wouldn't know which organizations are aligned with my goals. Um, I wouldn't even have access to these organizations. It's not, it's, it's, networking is so important here, and the, uh, the way that you network is quite important, because you will just spin your wheels meeting people, uh, and it, I don't know, I, I don't have time. I have to make sure that my networking is going to return. And it always does, and I always meet very interesting people. Um, even if it's not within my industry, I do always meet interesting people where I can apply something that they have learned, that I can learn as well. Shanghai is a city full, with, full of opportunities when you can go for networking events, or social networking. For example, I know there are a lot of opportunities organized by um, American Chamber of Commerce or like a different like Australian Chamber of Commerce or Canadian Chamber of Commerce or just regular social networking groups that were organized by experts. But in order to enjoy that opportunities, you have to um, try on your own. You can't just sit at home, be lazy and expect people to come to you one of the advantages that I have here is being a part of the Australian Chamber of Commerce. Um, so we hold uh, hundreds of events every year, um, mixing from business style events, educational events, to just general networking. Um, and when creating those, you really see the types of people that you know, benefit from networking in the right way and networking with the right groups. Um, supporting yourself, uh, surrounding yourself with like-minded people, with like-minded interests, um, really does start to help develop you as a person. Um, and in your career and finding new people that you want to associate with. It can be quite hard, some of the, the networking events are not for everyone um, and it can be quite pushy. Um, you know, the card culture here in China is, is quite intimidating at the start where you can go through 150 business cards in one night um, just by meeting new people. It does seem on the face quite uh, shallow. However, once you start getting those groups of people and understanding what they also want out of networking events, it, it becomes again beneficial for you to um, go to as many as you can and get to know new people and, and what they're doing in China as well.